What's good everybody? Welcome to the channel. And on this video today, as you can see from the screen, we are going over the Phantom Network. Okay, today it's currently down about 4.7% at the moment. Today is February 3rd, 2022. And this video, I'm just going to be going over the uh, technical analysis for Phantom, Phantom Opera and just giving a, a detail Given a detailed reason on the charts why, um, which direction I see price going in, and maybe we can get some insight on why Phantom Network is currently down. Okay, if that's something that you're interested in, smash the like button. It helps so much with the YouTube algorithm. And if you're new on this channel, we do everything crypto. That's NFTs, metaverse plays, passive income opportunities with the DeFi space, and so much more. Okay, so don't be shy. Smash the subscribe button. Let's get into the video. So let's go on to Phantom chart and let's jump on to daily. Okay, right off the bat, we see this big flicking eggplant of a bearish candle from yesterday's close. It shows strong bearish pressure to the downside, right? So basically we kind of, we're breaking below this support that we were stuck at. And if, if the day was to close with a bearish candle below, it would confirm the price has successfully broken below this support on the daily, at least from my rules standpoint. For your rules, maybe it has already broken support and that's okay. Your rules are your rules. Mine's are mine. And with this bearish candle, with this strong bearish candle close engulfing all these candles to the left, all these bullish candles to the left, I'm more bearish. It's signifying to me continuation of bearish the bearish direction or the downtrend that we currently were in from this lower high being formed here okay now what what can negate this bearish momentum to the downside would be a bullish engulfing candle of this extremely bearish candle from yesterday so essentially if, if price were to engulf this this area could still possibly print a double bottom which is a bullish reversal signal to the upside right so let's drop on the four hour and see what happens see how this candle is forming now from looking at the four hour it seems to be we seem to be in a well i notice a remove some of this drawing i see a well i can see some some lower highs right here lower low lower low and this seems to be either sideways moving the lower time frame or a lower high or a lower low right but as you all know if you've been following my channel for a while you should know that these are characteristics of a downtrend, right? It's it's a bit more sideways, but it's nonetheless it's still ticking downwards. So let's drop to the one hour. Once again, it's just giving us more detail as to how price was flowing to the downside, right? Because right there you see we had a head and shoulders. This would have been a beautiful entry after you see this bearish and golden candle form right here. After seeing, it's clear that we were in a and show the pattern at resistance. This is this bearish engulfing candle right here of this bullish candle to the left was your entry signal of the right shoulder successfully forming and price pushing strongly to the downside, right? And if you were to miss that entry, second entry opportunity would have been right here, right here. After seeing after price strongly pushing to the downside, retracing some, finding some resistance, and then continuing to the downside. That's another extremely beautiful entry opportunity that could have been taken advantage of if you were stuck in this pair. Okay. Now after that, we have more. One would have been also right here. If you want a 30 minute, right, push it down to that. And this, this, if you've seen my videos before, this is what I'm talking about when I say you want to see impulsively push, retrace some, find, print some entry reason to the downside, which would have been this strong bearish candle here, and then another one would be this hit um double top pattern right here and so forth right so basically even if, if let's say you have missed you would have missed those entries what do you do now right right now we're just waiting because you see prices came back we tested this level and seems to be playing around this area a couple of things can happen price could continue to move sideways right or price can find resistance and then continue on to the downside and that one may be a bit more probable since if you look at the higher time frame we are in in a downtrend and I would say that that direction will become a bit more clear after today's daily candle closes 
in my it is in my opinion that if the date does close bearishly we want dollar 40 is not far-fetched because after clearing all of the structure to the left here with a bearish close below here we have all of this clean traffic right here to the left right and essentially what clean traffic means or signifies is simply there's no impediment of price moving to the downside and to me impediments are uh consolidation areas um with, with price where price price where uh, places where price has wicked from before such as right here or simply put barriers like support and resistance okay and as you can see there are none of those at least on the daily right here and that's important because price is breaking support on the daily therefore the signal is being printed on the daily so this is a daily candle move right that's not to say that we can't see the uh on the floor is also clear price action right but that doesn't mean we can't see it on the lower time frames as well right now what we could notice here though if we look at it on the four hour this is what i'm seeing right now is this could be pay attention to this le uh, level right here or this zone right here if you want to call it a zone it seems like it could act as support right price could price could possibly break up above here and just basically continue the range in the zone or break above and go up so these are things to pay attention to don't get caught in the sideways trap right but i tell you this like i said if or if or when price breaks below here give us some sort of retest finding some sort of resistance and then a bearish injury is in the downside that is a profitable move same to the upside but we like i said we would get more more clarity on the direction that the market wants to go by waiting for the daily candle close today so that's the video guys if you enjoyed that video please give it a thumbs up if you're new subscribe okay it's free <laughs> but see you guys tomorrow